Hi, good evening, everybody. It has been a historic day for Cal Allen softball, taking on nationally ranked the Colony in the state semifinals up in Austin. And these Lady Cats came to play today, knocking off the Cougars 5-1. to one. Jeff Dubroff was there, and he is going to lead you every step of the way. Take a look. Allen, the Lady Wildcats had already made history by advancing to their first ever state tournament, but today they were trying to prove that they were just getting started. It would not be easy, the Wildcats facing off against one of the best teams in the state, the Colony. Carly Charles on the mound for the Cougars. Aviana Gonzalez leading things off with a walk, which is big. She ends up on third with two outs. Q Maddie Flores, who softly hits a dribbler to Charles, who then airmails the throw to first. Wildcats are on the board first. Lizette Dallin Hell on the mound for the Wildcats. She was superb, but faced trouble early. Jada Coleman steals second. Catcher Allie Wiggins' throw goes way past everyone in the outfield. Coleman would come all the way around to score. We're tied at one. Cal Allen would respond, though. Third inning, Jasmine Pena drops a blooper to left that goes out of the left fielder's glove. Safe at first, Aviana Gonzalez follows that up with a perfect bunt. All runners are safe, and that brings up Cat Flores, the senior leader, and she delivers. Shot up the middle, scores two, and the Wildcats are up three to one. Now, this might have been the play of the game right here. Cougars attempting a sack bunt. It pops into the air. Allie Wiggins makes a superb catch, then guns out the runner at first to turn the unbelievable double play and prevent a big inning. Now, top of the seventh. Wildcats looking for some insurance runs with two on. And once again, it's Cat Flores. Deep shot to right center. It gets down, scores two more. 5 1 Wildcats. And Lizette Dellon Hell, who allowed just one hit all game, strikes out the final batter, and that would do it. Wildcats pull off a stunner. They defeat the Colony 5 1. They advance to the state title game for the first time in program history. But head coach Teresa Lentz isn't surprised at all. You know, the girls work hard. They put themselves in a position, you know, to. To, to get a hit, they put themselves deep in the count. Uh, you know, Lizette's going to do her job and, and hit her spots and make those hitters have to really work to get a hit. Our defense is going to be right there to back her up, um, just like they've done. And so I knew it was I knew it was something very very possible. I know these girls have worked so hard to make sure that you know they're ready and take care of business, and, and they work. The Wildcats will take the field one last time tomorrow, but this time it's the state title on the line. Allen, back to you. All right, Jeff, thank you. And they will get Angleton. Angleton needed extra innings to beat Forney today. That'll be a 3 o'clock game tomorrow. The gold medal certainly up for grabs, and uh, we're wishing Cal Allen the very best of luck.